Hi guys, it's Claire from Imagination Vines Love. I'm back with a daily reading. Um, hope you guys have been having a good day. Uh, whenever you are listening to this, this is also a timeless reading as well. So you can watch it whenever you need. Um, if you're clicking on this message now, um, pretty much means that there is a part of you, whether you're conscious of it or not, uh, there is a part of you that is going through this. I do not believe that messages um, aren't for the reader. I believe that they are divinely timed. So uh, yeah, let's get straight into the reading and see what is coming up. Right, so I have the Quantum Oracle um, deck, and I'm so excited to use this a bit more while I'm away. So let's see what is coming up in the house. Oh, right. Wow, that card came out pretty fast. So we have new cycle and look there's like a little baby down the bottom can you see that there's like a little baby and he's so happy he or she looks so happy in the light in the background um very abundant uh what does it look like a little human down here but it's it's not um it's just like very abundant new beginnings um if you guys can see that hold on new beginnings isn't that cool I love the purple in this this reminds me of like I guess like a little bit of self-love um when it comes to this card because you know kids need they need a lot of nutrients and they need a lot of love but the purple I just think of like lavender and and love for some reason but anyway then the next card let's have a look We have gosh these keep coming out um, same sort of energy of course I would have to say so our first card of the day second card of the day is called transformation so as you can see in this card so hard to show you that um, the bottom part but it says transformation and it's of this lady and she's walking across this bridge right and if you can see in the far distance it's like there's this new earth being created behind her that is what she is creating and how she's doing that is by doing her inner work um, her shadow work should I say um, but I believe in inner work it's, it's a little bit kinder and um, yeah anyway so and she can see like she is creating a new world for herself. So this is about transforma transformation. And as she is right here, she's like, okay, I've got all this transformation that I'm doing within. Um, and it's it's manifesting in the background. Like you can see it, she's building this new earth. That is so cool. I love it. I love it. See what else is here. And by the way, guys, I am um, on holiday. Um, oh, a creative endeavor. So, in events. So, with the transformation card and um, the new beginnings, I feel like there are um, some people that may be traveling a little bit. Um, which is really quite interesting because I am currently on holiday. But what this is talking about is, is actually about um, like diving more into like your creativity and um, becoming an artist within um, really drawing on what you want for your life. Um, yeah, and you can do this on paper. You can you can really get quite creative with this because this is your life. You are transforming and 
yeah, I feel like this is all about like what you desire. Um, and if you guys like your music, then that's probably something to do with music. <laughs> Not a very good singer, but um, yeah, this is really cool. I like this card. Next card. I think I might use two out of here and call it a day. Um, this is just a quick reading, really, um, to see what's kind of going on in your day. See what's coming. So, first card is the Courageous Peony. Multifaceted, unique nature, let yourself be seen. So this is about transforming into your true self. So hard to see that. Your true self. Oh, look, there's a human in there. <laughs> I didn't see that. I can't. Oh, <laughs> look at that. That's so cool. So, um. Yeah, it's about being seen and being your true self. And you can do this by doing your inner work um, and, like, sifting out all those areas that feel bad within. Um, yeah, I'm sure there's a bigger message in the book, but we're just going to continue. That's what I'm being guided to say. So, yeah. Loosen your grip, coping mechanisms, density, addiction, let God in. So this is, um, again, about the transformation um, and becoming yourself. So you're holding on to something. You are holding on to something too tightly. Um, allow yourself to let that free. Um, as you can see, this, this girl, she's falling um, because she doesn't feel like she's safe, right? She doesn't feel like she can be safe being herself. Um, but you are safe. The God's all around us. This, uh, the universe is all around us. We are, um, you know, we are the universe's little children. Um, we can never, never be safe, if that makes sense. So this transformation that we're going through at the moment is about becoming more of our authentic self. Um, I love this. There's so many like colors in, in these these cards. They're so beautiful. Right, one more, and then um, yeah, that's me. All done. Let's see what this one has to say. Karmic relationships. It says Orion energy, polarity, and soul growth, growth and conflict. So. <laughs> Let me kind of just channel this a little bit. So what I get from this is, again, the transformation. Seeing things from... Oh! Sorry about that, guys. <laughs> just got a call. Um... Uh, the message that I'm actually getting from this card is about karmic relationships, right? People around us that we are um, no longer aligning with. Um, and this is also about like your old self, right? We are no longer aligning with our old self. So our old self is actually completely in a different earth to us. And this is us looking back. And so when I look at this card, this is her walking from one earth to a new earth as you can see so this is all about transforming into who we want to be so writing down what you desire and what you want out of your life this is a good beginning um, and if you are in relationships they may be um, like coming to an end or um, working out a new way to work with these people so um, you know a new method right um, because things aren't um, working as as they used to, like the status quo, right? Um, so, yeah, anyway, that's your message, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will talk to you again soon. Bye.